Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with my update one on my Spring Fling Project Pan. Now I know it's been quite a while since I've posted the intro. I think it's been like a month and a half, but I've been having problems with my camera and I have recently fixed it. So I am gonna be starting to do updates now. So the first thing I'm gonna go ahead and talk about is the Milani Matte Passion Lipstick. This is like an orangey red lipstick and I have not made no progress on this whatsoever. I haven't even used it yet, so this has no progress. The next thing is the MAC Tumble Dry Lipstick, which is like an orangey peachy color. And surprisingly, I like this. It's not like a favorite of mine, but I do like it. And I've used this quite a bit this past month and a half. The next thing is this right here. This is the Milani Bella Rouge Bella Eyes Gel Powder Eyeshadow. Now I've only used this about once or twice, so there's probably not going to be no signs of use since my intro. But it is a very pretty shade. And this is what it looks like right there. But I've enjoyed it the two times that I did wear it, and I'm going to start using this a little bit more. The other eyeshadow that I have in this project pan is from the Essay Lauder Deluxe Eyeshadow Compact. And this is my pan that palette for the year. And this is what it looks like right there. And I've used quite a bit up. I mean, I could have used more, but I think I'm doing a decent job at using it even though I know I could be doing better. But yeah. The next thing is this blushing stick right here. I've used this a lot and just doesn't seem to be going fast enough, but I have been using it. And I'll do another swatch to see what it looks like. There we go. And that's it right there. I do enjoy using this for it being a cream product. I don't really use cream products, but I do enjoy this for what it is. But if I, like I wouldn't miss it if it was gone, but I do enjoy it. The two blushes that I have is the last things I think, yes. This one is the Too Faced Sweethearts Perfect Fluff Flush Blush in Candy Glow. And I have been using this recently, but it just doesn't seem to be like going anywhere. like. You can't see a difference because it was basically brand new. I've only used it like once or twice before. And this is like basically my oldest blush for my high-end blushes. So yeah, I have been using it, but I don't know if you can even tell a difference. Now the thing that actually went pretty fast and I have hit my goal on it is this right here. Is this the e.l.f. blush and candid coral. And this was a brand new blush that I haven't even used and I've already hit paint on this. Um, it went pretty fast. I guess whenever I dipped my brush in it, it did like kick up a lot of product and stuff like that. So I've already hit pan on this. So this is completed. But I'm going to continue using it with the Too Faced blush just because this one is more of a pink and I'll show you. It's more of a baby pink and it's not like my favorite blush. So I put the other blush on top. There it is right there. I don't even know if you'll be able to see that. It's not even pigmented enough there. But yeah, that's what it looks like right there. So I put this on top to tone down the pinkness of it just because that right there is not one of my favorite types of colors to wear. And it just like crumbled. Like, I don't even know if you'll be able to see it, but it's like crumbling everywhere. But that's what that one looks like right there, which I actually enjoyed using it because it does give a nice glow to your face. So yeah, that is everything. Out of seven products, I hit my goal on one. And I highly doubt I'm going to actually hit my goal on anything else because I do want to use up this green shade in here. I want to hit pan on this right here. Use as much up as I can with this and it goes so slow so I don't think that's gonna happen and the same with these but I'm at least I'm getting love out of them 
and I don't know if I will be able to be able, I don't know if I'm going to keep this once this project is done just because it's not a color that I wear very often. But I don't know, I could love it so I haven't even used it so I can't give it a chance. So yeah, but that is it for this video you guys. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, thank you guys. Bye.